Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at HobbyFarms.com. They have an article on mobile processing units. You know, basically, if you're a poultry farmer, your profit margins are usually very, very low. One of the largest expenses is feed. If you want to lower that cost, I would recommend a fodder system or growing sprouted grains for uh, feed. But the processing of the poultry is also very pricey because most states and countries do not allow you to process your own poultry for sale to consumers unless you have a, a commercial kitchen like the one pictured here. This is inside of a converted horse trailer made by uh, Kentucky State University, if I remember correctly. Now, as you can see, all the surfaces are washable. It's got the hand washing station, the three bay sink, typical of any commercial kitchen, but it also has scalders to help get rid of any extra feathers, a deep plucking unit, and all sorts of other industry-specific tools like killing cones. Now, Richard Perkins on YouTube has built a great one of these over in Sweden. This one is, of course, in America. But it might be a little expensive. In this article, there's some names of companies that sell these units. And, of course, you can buy one. It, they talk about possibly renting one, too, from a local extension service, your county extension office. They may know of some that are available to rent. That is probably your best bet if you're a small-scale poultry farmer. If you are more medium to large scale, though, perhaps build one. Get yourself a uh, car hauler or another enclosed trailer. Maybe you can use a flatbed trailer as well. Some states and municipalities do allow open-air slaughter and processing of chickens. So this is just another example of how you can make more money as a small farmer if you can find a way, not necessarily around the regulations, but the cheapest, most efficient way to work within the confines of the law while still making a profit for your small farm. You don't need a massive facility. You don't even need to build a facility. You might be able to rent one. Of course, I will link to this article in the description if you want to read more about it. At the bottom of the article, it talks about the basics of what you might need to process chickens in your backyard. Coolers with ice, a nice clean surface that you can easily clean, like stainless steel, preferably a defeatherer, a canning pod and propane grillettes to get the feathers nice and loose, and a killing cone to help kill the bird and drain the fluids. Again, I will link to this article in the description if you want to read more about it. And if you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.